looks like um, something we could have made at the crib. Oh, uh, we about to do that anyway. We want to, you, baby. We know, we know who it is. We know who you are. We got the IP address. It's there. It's nothing you can say. So we're just collecting the data. So when we come to you, it's nothing you can say. It's a scheme that Todd said to come to you. <laughs> some what was I gonna do different no when you pop it hold the cork like at the top like when you pop it out do it slow and hold the cork at the top I know how to open up a motherfucker you baby I know how to the okay, thing well, I know how to open up me a motherfucking box you the no I didn't didn't <laughs> I ain't worried about it baby so guess what don't worry about me baby Worry about your motherfucking self, cause I'm guess what? I'm a key, it come, comes with a capital G. I'm wrong. Do you guys have any bananas at this location? Um, let me go check for ya. Unfortunately, we do not have any today. Okay, that's fine. A iced chai tea latte, please, made with almond milk. Iced chai tea latte made with almond milk. What size was that? Let's do venti with some vanilla sweet cold foam on top. All right, what else for ya? And then, do you guys have a grilled cheese? You said the grilled cheese? Yes. Yes, we do. Alright, I'll have that shelf before you open the window. Thanks. May I have um, a straw and some napkins, please? Yeah. Alright, there you go. Thank you, appreciate it. And there's your card, and then I'll have the rest right out for you. Thank you. Just checking in, so. I made it to um, DC. Um, we're about to go and surprise Chelsea. Uh, what time is it? Kia, what time is it? Um, it's like a little after eight. Yeah, so we're gonna go to the restaurant maybe like mm, 15 minutes early. Um, just so we can get there and kind of like get situated. Um, so when she walks in, we'll be at the table. And after that, I really don't know what our plans are, but it's going to be super fun and super cute because she's going to be surprised. You can't get anything past um, Chelsea. And y'all, do not mind my makeup. I'm, it's like not how it's supposed to be. But Key is here. So, um, yeah, we're excited to surprise her. Um, and her boyfriend like did a really good job like kind of orchestrating everything. I'm going to go fix his makeup because this is awful. And then my mustache is peeking through. This is stupid. So yeah. <clears throat> I literally had to, well we had to um, come in here and start getting dressed. So we didn't really have time to like think about fits. And last night I packed at like 2 a.m. I didn't have anything. Oh no. Fuck no. This is not going to be. I'm literally. This camera shows everything, bro. Oh, so I fixed the brow. Like, you see it's dark now. But <clears throat> I forgot to mention my haircut to you guys. Um, 
and my hair like i got it dyed black um like months ago and it still looks super dark um but yeah so you have to tell me what you guys think but i like it it's just short and i feel like i don't know i like it um but i really need to cut my hair because i wanted it to grow back a certain way and i felt like from me like wearing sew-ins back to back to back to back to back because I don't wear wigs, but like me wearing sewings back to back to back, it was like thinning out my hair or something. So I like wanted to cut it to get it back like full. So you guys have to tell me what you think. And yes, yeah, so as far as my outfit, I literally have on um, the um, Ali B. Mendoza um, set jewelry, um, of course jbw i have this ring on <laughs> i thought that was kia kia i thought she was yeah, I'm trying to get your oh okay so um this ring i forget what her brand is you want to say something oh okay hold on so i forget what her brand is but it's the yellow tiger on instagram i got this ring from like her brand like i want to say like months ago it was cold outside nowhere in the time so i don't even know she still has it available because i haven't looked at her stuff in a long time and then um cartier rings on this hand um and then i have on i didn't put on a necklace because i don't know i just didn't feel like it and then for my shoes i think i'm just gonna wear these shoes that i got from zara like these really cute sandals hold on and then let me see what key want um but i'll show you guys it's these um they're like adorable to me and then they're really comfortable and because we're gonna be like walking around a lot i think I, it's best that i wear some comfortable shoes no, it's okay. oh. it's okay. um um so yeah like i said we're excited we're getting ready to head out because if not we're gonna be late and messing with kia we'll be in here all night <laughs> so chelsea i can't wait for you to watch this so you can see that we were in here getting ready. And what's so funny is like we had to lie. Because Chelsea will take all day. So we basically had to lie and tell her boyfriend like, oh, you know, because of COVID, we only had the table for two hours. So she's really going to have to be on time. So hopefully they still come on time. Hopefully. Because then that defeats the purpose of us lying. But um, yeah, we got to do something to get this girl on time. So, Kia, you got anything you want to say? No, not really. Never. Not yet. not yet. But yeah, so, I'll check in with you guys. Oh, we're going to, I don't think I said it. We're going to this restaurant called RPM. We actually used an Italian spot in um, D.C. that we really like because we went there. Like, what year was that? I don't even know. I was like 2017, 2018. I think it was 2016, huh? No. 17? I uh -uh. I don't where I was at, like. Oh, okay. Well, anyways, Kia said she think it was 2017. I think it was 2016. Find out at the end of this video who's actually right. Um, But we went to this place, and it was really good. And Chelsea really, really likes Italian food. And the thing is, she really didn't want to go here because we already been here before. Um, But, like, I don't know what it is about D.C. It's like, if you, when you're picking a restaurant, um, you're either going to get, like, really good food but like a shitty kind of like um aesthetic or like atmosphere or you get the atmosphere but the food is okay but like rpm like the food is actually good and it's like cute in there um so we decided to go with that so i hope you're not mad when you see this show see but yeah we picked it <laughs> so <laughs> um yeah guys come on come with us
dabbing with niggas like a trying to get my angles together. <laughs> okay, so guys, we just woke up. And last night we were like, I don't know, like um overwhelmingly tired. So we came back, we like listened to some music, chilled. Um, because when we looked at the clock, it was one, it was like <clears throat> one something. So it's like, uh, do we really want to go somewhere for like 30 minutes or do we just want to start the day over tomorrow? Because we all had been traveling. Like, Kia went from Hong Kong to um, <clears throat> Kentucky to uh, Denver <laughs> to DC. And Chelsea literally came from Alaska at four in the morning <laughs> and got here. So it's just like, I don't know. I don't know. We were just tired. Even the even though the birthday girl was trying to act like, oh, I'm not tired. Let's go out. Let's go out. Let's go out. She was like, I'm going downstairs. I'm gonna fix my hair and change my shoes. We call her. Guess what she was doing? In the bed. So we um we stayed in, but it is what time is it? It's like ten o'clock. <clears throat> Miss Mama's over here has been up with the roosters. <laughs> she wakes up early, opens up the blinds. I don't know, are, is anyone else like that? Like, I cannot sleep with light. Like, that's my alarm clock. If somebody opened blinds, that's going to wake me up because I like it to be like pitch black. Pitch, pitch black, nothing on, like just knocked out. <clears throat> so, today we're going to a brunch spot. So, we're about to get ready in a little bit. Um,. And I don't know what else we're doing for the rest of the day. I'll try to get like as much footage as possible. Um, right now I just have on <clears throat> Skims. I think this is like the cotton collection. It's the dress. Oh, I should show y'all the stuff that I tried yesterday for the first time. Because I had it for a long time. And I just tried it. Let's see. <clears throat> okay. So, I posted this on my Instagram. But, <clears throat> just to kind of go through... A couple of my favorite things. We have this buddy right here. This is my favorite flat iron. Like Babyliss Pro Prima 3000. This right here. It's like really cool because it locks. Okay, so it locks right there. It gets your hair super straight. And it has hot plates on the outside. You hold it. Right here at the tip, but it has hot plates on the outside. If you want your hair bone straight, this is going to work. I mainly use um, heating tools with my, um, why was it not camera? I mainly use heating tools with my weave. Don't mind my lashes. My lash girl can't sit on me. So they're like all falling out. They're all over the place. But I mainly use heating tools with my weave. I don't use it um, on my natural hair that much. I'm trying to like stay away from it. So yeah. Let's start with um, Necessar. Um, I'm not sure because I got everything else fragrance free. I'm not sure if this comes fragrance free. Um, I don't think a, the body wash does, but that's called sandalwood. It smells really good though. Like I like it. And it's, I really, really love it. Love my skin really, really soft. So it's no hype behind it. And it's not super expensive. Like I don't remember how much it was for the whole set, but I'm going to tag it in the description box below. So next we have these Pixie eye patches. I usually, I'm probably about to put these on now, <clears throat> but um. They have, like, I don't believe in spending a lot of money on eye patches. So many brands, um, or, like, prestige brands sell, um, like, these eye pads. And it's really, like, to me, those don't even really work. These actually work. And when I say work, because, of course, like, they're not magically going to take bags from under your eyes. But these really actually reduce the puffiness. And I like to put them on before I'm going to do my makeup. So that I don't have to be really heavy on like my concealer and stuff like that. Or just like put them on if I'm about to like run out somewhere. And I don't really feel like putting on makeup. They kind of like help my eyes go down. Because I have really puffy eyes. This is by Crave Beauty. This is literally the only um, skincare brand that I found that I've actually liked. Because all of these brands, um, I'm not going to say any names. But they have like fragrance in their cleansers and stuff like that. And majority or... To, for me, 
um, when I spoke with my esthetician, she was saying anything that has fragrance in it, um, you want to run from like off rip. So um, all of these are natural ingredients, they're very easy on the skin, like they're for all skin skin types. So I have like somewhat of, um, I have like combination skin. So I have certain problem areas like my chin and like around my mouth and stuff. And then that's it pretty much. I don't have problems on my cheek areas or um, my forehead or anything like that. But I pretty much love these. I love the cleanser. It doesn't feel like um, it dries you out. It literally is so moisturizing. Like it's almost gone. I have to get another one. But and this brand is super like inexpensive. I think for all of this, it was less than a hundred dollars. You know, you have like Tatcha and those brands, and I love those brands. It's certain um, stuff that I use by them too. Love, 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 love. I didn't bring my exfoliant that they offer or that they have because it's in my drawer, and I just exfoliate before I came. I'm only gonna be here two days. I really only do it like twice. Or three times a week. So it was no point in me just bringing it. And then, um, yeah. So that's really good, the cleanser. And then I usually, after I cleanse, I follow up with the barrier relief. I only put this on when I'm about to go out during the day. I don't put it on in the house. I'm like around the house. Um, but yeah. And the cool thing about these products, while I'm, while I'm thinking about it, is that on the back it tells you when you could use it. Or like um, what it's for and everything. And like just pretty much you know the what series it is and all the ingredients and how to apply it is like all on the back so that's super convenient i love 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 that and then so after i use the matcha hemp hydrating cleanser i follow up with the great berry relief and then this is like probably my favorite out of everything this water cream like this is the moisturizer so <clears throat> yeah i put this on after those two and then i go on about my day and then we have Dove, like <laughs> my deodorant. Um, the cucumber one is spa, like that's my favorite one, right? Then I just bought, um, <clears throat> eventually I'm gonna do a perfume haul or a fragrance haul. I just bought this one, I recently got it like I want to say a couple months ago. You see, my name's on it. Um, it smells so good, and you know what's funny with this? I'm gonna get it. Well, you know what? I ain't gonna tell y'all, we're just gonna save that over here. I have my watches <clears throat> by JBW. Love, love, love. Can't remember what they're called. I have to tag them below. Yeah, I can't remember what they're called, but yeah, I have to tag them below. And then here, the set that like everyone has, like one, of, it's my favorite. And I love gold jewelry, but I don't know. I like both equally as much. Is anybody else like that? Like I like gold. I don't know because I feel like it complements my skin well, but I also like. I don't know. I like the white gold or silver from time to time. So, Christian Dior. This is a choker. Bracelet. Um, these rings were the rings that I mentioned like in my last video. I got these from Nimi Glow. And then, bracelet from Nimi Glow. The tennis bracelet. And then this is from Nimi Glow. Um, yes. And I wish I could show you guys. Like, hold on. Look at my makeup case. It's destroying. Like, I really have to clean it out. I really have to clean it out but like oh my god it's destroyed but some of my favorite things are in here and some of them I accidentally left but um my seven sprays that I love Morphe is like an inexpensive one if you really want a good one but inexpensive that one's really good I love this Urban Decay oh no this is Tarte actually um that um Tarte Stay Spray is really really good it's just it's a little pricey and it smells like cucumber I love it it's like I don't know refreshing and then um like i would put this in my purse this little one sometimes i would put it in my purse and just spray it on and keep spraying while i'm out because it's just refreshing and um i'll have the mac one of course that everyone has and then this is like smashbox it's i don't know if it's really my favorite primer because the makeup artists that i really like like makeup artists use different stuff for primer <clears throat> one makeup artist that i really like um has that Mario Badesco. She uses that as a primer, but I'm not really a fan of his products, so I don't know, but it seems like whenever she does my makeup, it lays. Like, it stays on forever. It's like dewy, but not too dewy. It's, it's just, I don't know, so maybe I do need to get it, even though I don't care for it. Um, and I'm gonna wash my face every night, even though I don't like to sleep in makeup. So, and then another um, primer that I really like is gonna be 
the Pond's Cream. I have to, I don't have one in here with me, but the Pond's Cream, I've had another makeup artist use that. But you know, I'm gonna try, it's like called, I think it's called like Milk or something. I don't know. But um, I'm gonna try it. <clears throat> and then we're not gonna get too deep into this. Uh, for my brows, to seal them, I use Benefit Brow. 24 hour brow setter if it focuses there we go um i love that <clears throat> and then this is the brow pencil that i use and i also it's called precisely my brow pencil in the shade um number five um my favorite favorite lashes are by um i think it's baddie b yeah baddie b lashes literally so i think it's i can't remember what the names are they have so many different names oh baby doll and then you have these which are called saucy so i was right i was about to say saucy so <clears throat> love those oh and then i just want to show you guys my lip combo but my real lip combo i can't show you because um i'm out of my favorite which i don't know it's really not a lip gloss it's just a um a treatment oil so, um, I have to tag it in the description box below or just show you guys one day. i lining my lips with cork by MAC. The pencil is like up here. Oh my God. Now who did, that's some hate and shade. Cause who told you to fall? I line my lips with cork every time. Or like a brown, any brown pencil that you have. So that's London. Love that. This is, um, let's see. One that I'm really not a fan of. So I didn't mean to pick up that one. Where's Madeline? Okay. Madeline or Madeline. Love, love, love. Let's see if you guys can see it by NYX. Um, then I have another one because that's like my favorite. And then we have London, and then we have Abu Dhabi. Love those. Love a neutral lip, nude lip. Can never go wrong with it. Literally goes with everything. But yeah, that's pretty much. I wanted to show you guys a couple things. Um, and I'm practicing on makeup and practicing and practicing. I'm really honestly, I feel like I'm gonna end up paying like to take. A, um, I feel like I'm gonna end up paying to take a class because. I really like it and I really have products but it just for some reason I don't know if I'm not putting on it enough like heavy foundation or something <clears throat> but for some reason like it's just not ever giving what it's supposed to give how like it does when makeup artists so I'm gonna figure that out but yeah <clears throat> so I'm about to chill here for maybe like a little bit I don't know what time it is now but I'm about to get ready Go to brunch, wake up Chelsea, and get the day started. Hopefully it doesn't rain today and it's like nice weather. We'll see them.
I fuck them like porn stars Ooh, and playing basketball, but my bitches is all stars. Got bitchy on my wrist, cause I'm richer than most broads. Your niggas bitches trippin', let's send them a postcard. I put on my jewelry just to go to the bodega. And I keep it with me just so that I'm feeling safer. Fendi on my body, but my feet is in bodega. Bitch, I'm getting money, give a fuck about a hair. That's it. You said that's it. You want to know? Don't give me no bullshit. That bullshit. Don't give me no bullshit.